Compulsion. It's like some other voice is telling me, no, I'm not hungry. I've already eaten. I've had a massive lamb sandwich. Um, my name is AJ Rochester. Um, I'm 208 pounds, which is just like two people, two Hollywood actresses. I'm, my measurements are 45, 42, 49. My BMI is just, it's like 38 or 39 or something. And my body fat is 41% body fat. So, uh, I'll tell you, it doesn't get much worse than this. I am an Aussie, but I live in Beverly Hills, California. And um, I'm about to take the Visalis 90 day challenge. I've got the transformation kit, just came just now. Oh my God. Um, I. Um, you know, I'm dying just admitting this, but, uh, huh, you know, I said I was going on a diet eight weeks ago and I've put on 18 pounds since. So obviously there's something really radical in my life that needs to change. And, um, you know, it's the first time ever that I've actually really, um, done something that is going to really take away the emotional eating aspect that is destroying my life. And, um, you know, I came to America two and a half years ago and, you know, a whole heap of things happened. Um, I had a car accident and I hurt my back and I had back surgery and, uh, the job I came for fell through. I faced homelessness. Um, you know, it, it's been a really tough time. I'm a single mum. I have a 12 year old son who has, um, Asperger's, which is, um, high functioning autism and it's tough and I'm you know, alone and lonely and depressed and I uh, have a deep and meaningful relationship with food and I don't even need to be hungry. I eat and eat and eat and until I feel sick. I eat when I'm angry. I eat when I'm happy. I eat when I'm sad. Um, I am burying myself and my career in food and it's horrifying you know I it's a huge demon in my life and you try to eat to cover up the disgust and the pain and it just creates more and you just get bigger and bigger and bigger and then you just don't want to go out you don't want to do anything you don't want to meet anyone and uh you know I for me I really needed to to make a drastic change and so I've decided that I'm going to spend the next 90 days Transforming every part of my life, uh, starting with the food addiction, obsession, whatever it is, and um, just taking that away from me, um, which is, you know, doing the Visalis um, transformation kit so that I can eradicate that part of, um, you know, that is, is sabotaging my life and then work on all the other aspects, you know, like I'm going to set myself challenges every single day. I want to lose at least 25 pounds in 90 days. Um, I don't want to get too obsessed with numbers because it just does my head in. Um, but, you know, I need to change 
so much of my life. You know, I had a major meltdown two days ago. Uh, you know, I'm sitting here just with my life really not where I imagined it would be, nor where it should or could be. So um, I'm going to do everything I can to turn my life around and, uh, and also give my son um, a better life. So I'm nervous that I'm just going to fail like I've failed every other time over the last um, two and a half years. You know, I, I used to be 300 pounds, over 300 pounds, and I lost weight, and I more or less kind of kept it off for about 10 years. And then just since kind of falling into the depression that I've been in, I just um, just keep going back to these ways where I just am eating myself to death. Very lonely, painful death so um i i just no hoo-ha no hurrah this is just day one and really how i was feeling two days ago um there was really no other place for me to go than up so that's what i'm really hoping that i'm going to achieve on this challenge is to come out of this with my mind, body and spirit in a lot better place than it is right now.